Here's the deal. I'm having the wife of a pretty famous NFL football player on the show today, but I am not having her on just because she's some famous football player's wife or because her husband's in the playoffs. I've invited her on the show because she's a mother of four children trying to raise her children well, whether her family is in the celebrity spotlight or not. And her awesome example of motherhood is just like a lot of other moms you'll never hear about. And this gives me the opportunity to remind everyone that their job as a mom or a dad is more important than any role that a celebrity may play. That stuff is very important when we forget that in our culture, where we get swept away by limousines and millionaires and the people who walk down red carpets. So whenever I get the chance, I try to remind my fellow Americans of the people outside of the celebrity spotlight, who we call average, even though they're doing one of the most important jobs on the planet called parenthood. The widow who is raising three kids all by herself and helping them with their homework long after the sun sets and praying by their bedsides because no one else is there to pray for them. The dad who works two jobs to pay for the hospital bills of his sick child. The grandma who's raising two babies because mom and dad can't. And the foster parents who love on children who no longer have parents of their own. Those people are doing the great work on this planet. Work that matters. And this is my chance to allow this NFL mom to remind us that even though her husband is in the spotlight, she is loving and training and comforting and praying for her children, just like the rest of us. And it's those things, the small and unnoticed things that go into raising a child into the kind of person who will also be a loving parent someday. It's those small and unnoticed things outside of the celebrity spotlight that really, really matter to the future of our world. So thank you, God, for moms and dads everywhere. Isn't that right, Shelly? Today's a day for me to say, can I get an amen? You can get an amen. (laughs) 